H2K Infosys provides world-class online IT training, staffing and software testing solutions to customers worldwide. H2K Infosys supports 100% job-oriented training, hands-on project work, cloud test lab, resume preparation and review, mock interviews, robust syllabus, one-time pay, lifetime access to live classes and videos. H2K Infosys has won the trust of thousands of students worldwide. For free demo class, visit h2kinfosys.com. Hello everyone, welcome to this interesting series on Selenium Interview, Question and Answers by H2K Infosys. I am Sonal Mittal and we will be discussing the top Selenium Interview questions that will be helpful for freshers as well as professionals. So now, let us look at the questions that are very frequently asked during the interviews. Now here is our today's question. What is the major difference between driver.close and driver.quit? Guys, it is a very, very simple question, but also it is a very important question when, come, when it comes to Selenium scripting. Driver.close and driver.quit, here method close and quit performs an operation which is closing the browsers. Okay, now. There are two, it, at two different instances, you can use driver.close or driver.quit. So, when should we use driver.close? When this command driver.close is called, it will close the browser's current window. If we have a window and there are multiple tabs on it, if you call driver.close in your script, the script will then close the current browser window. Okay, suppose you want to close the entire session, the entire browser session, then you will use driver.quit. So, the quit method in Selenium is called on the driver instance, okay, when there are one or more browser windows open and it closes all the browser windows. It closes all the tabs. If there is one window open and there are multiple tabs in it, it will close all of those if a session is using two or three windows, then when you call driver.quit, it will close all the windows. Whereas driver.close will only close that particular tab or the current browser window. Okay, so let us see these two methods, how it is called in a Selenium script with the help of a Selenium script. So here, if you see the screen, I have an existing Selenium script wherein I am opening the driver instance. Driver is an instance which is used to open the Chrome browser because I am using the Chrome driver here. Then I am calling up, I am uh, using the get method to open Selenium web page. And then I am using the robo class of Selenium so as to open multiple tabs. Now, how to open multiple tabs that is part of a different series that is part of a different video that will, I, i'll take it up later for today we will concentrate on driver.close or driver.quit here after we open multiple tabs i am also trying to open in one of the tabs i'm trying to open selenium website in, a, in the same tab that i'm trying to open another website jquery ui okay now my task is First, to see what happens when we execute driver.close when or when we call driver.close method okay in Selenium script. Basically, driver.close and or driver.quit methods are always written in the end of a script. Remember that. It is always written towards the end of the script. It is the last method that we call in our test Selenium script. Okay. So when you call driver.close, in the current script, I am opening three one drive browser window. In the browser window, I am opening three tabs. Okay. And towards the end, my driver instance will be pointing to the very first tab. So when we call driver.close, it is going to close only the first tab where the instance is working 
okay so let me execute this script and show you with driver dot close it closes the browser current window or current tab so let me execute this script for you if you see it has opened the first tab second tab and third tab now it is again pointing to the first tab it is opening another url which i'm calling and now it should close the first tab that is driver dot close now let us see what happens when we execute driver dot quit method in selenium script okay so i will comment this one and we will call only driver dot quit it is recommended that you either call driver dot close or driver dot quit in your selenium script it's not required that you should call both okay now as i said in driver dot quit all the tabs the entire browser session window will be closed okay in close driver dot close we close the only that particular tab which the driver instance is working with in driver dot quit all the sessions of the driver instance will be closed so let us execute the script now and see the difference between close and quit these are direct methods in selenium close and quit so here the script is executed and it is open three tabs it is now opening jquery.qi and now if you will see it has quickly closed the browser window on the whole not just the tab but the all the tabs all the windows okay i hope driver.close and driver.quit difference is very much clear to you and you should be able to answer it in your interviews all the very best everyone thank you